Hey guys, what is going on? My name is Dremek and welcome to the first episode of this new series. Now, as you can see, I pre-recorded all this stuff about a week in advance, so I'm just commentating over this. Um, so you can see me, this is on my level 80 character, driving around my yacht. Um, it's called Mr. Rosper 6, for those of you who wanted to know, or for me looking back on this, wanting to remember. And I've got my level 80 character, and um, I've got level 120 character. And I kind of felt an addiction, okay? As you're going to hear in this, I am not the best at playing the GTA Online legitimately. So, I thought, hey, if I'm basically recording myself the whole time, there's no way I can cheat and glitch, right? So I was like, right, so, you'll, you'll hear me to some logistics on this, but I think this series starting over, just after the new Casino Heist DLC is dropped, will be my eighth time starting over, making the character that you're about to see me start creating, depending on how I shift the edit hitting the videos around and whatnot, um, my ninth character in this game, which is, you know, a bit mental, not gonna lie, but I thought, hey, it's fun, I've always enjoyed starting over in GTA Online, um, just for context, I do not have Twitch Prime, I, I could in theory get it, but I'm just choosing not to, and I'm also not gonna do any money glitches or hack, um, it's kind of like, I've ditched characters, my level 8 character that you saw around the yacht, I did a bunch of the facility replay glitches on, and my, um, a lot of my old Grand Theft Remic characters, I would use mod menus to get money on for episode to episode. Um, but you can see me here making my character. I don't think I'm going to shift this around all that much. Yeah, but on my most recent character, I was basically too rich. And yeah, I'd started using like glitches um, towards the end to afford more and more things. Because I started getting bored and whatnot. So I thought it's probably time for me to restart. So yeah, as you can see, I've deleted those two characters off the face of the earth right now. You're going to hear me from around a week ago start this. I'm sorry this episode's so long, a lot of them are going to be long. Some of these are going to be me talking over it like I am now, um, and some of them are going to be sort of live commentary, and some of them might be a mix. Um, it depends, there might be like highlights where, in the moment where I'm still recording audio from Discord calls I'm in at the time, that I might choose to include. But with that said, I hope that you enjoy this series. <coughs> okay, that took longer than I thought it would. Um, right, we're skipping this tutorial. Um, so you've probably just seen a sped up version of that. Um, I deleted the two GTA characters that I have so far made on this account. Both of them owned pretty much everything that was out in the game at the time. Uh, the character you saw me playing on in the beginning was... I think I made that before the Casino DLC came out. And the one that I have recently been playing on was, um... The one that was made after that DLC came out. Anyway, okay. Th this looks new, from what I've seen. Oh, I didn't back out of the thing, did I? Okay, well, I've never actually seen this tutorial, so, um... I mean, fair enough. Eh. I mean, I suppose this is a good way to get back into the game. I was feeling... I still wanted to play GTA, but I just felt there was nothing else for me to do. I own God knows how much. Um, on two accounts, mind you, so, uh... Restarting for the tenth time. <laughs> um, some of you remember Grand Theft and Remic. Um... Yeah, so, in about total, I've been banned about seven times on this game. Wait, no, I've been banned about five times, four of them were my fault. One of them was my Spanish friend's Juan's fault. Um, then I restarted on PlayStation, I restarted twice on the last two. So, this might actually be my 9-3 set, but let's say, so far, I've been banned, I've been banned five times? Yeah, I've been banned five times. I've played one account on PlayStation 4, I've played two on this account so far. This makes it my ninth GTA Online character, which sounds really sad, honestly. And it is. Um, bonus, though, I don't care about copyright dissection, so... Um, oh, you know I'm going to be listening to Britney Spears in this. Oh, seriously, though. Um, okay. What that shit do, you big old pimp, you? <laughs> you a business motherfucker now, huh? That's what I'm talking about. Come here, holler at your boy, man. It's good to finally meet you, man. After all that time on Life Invaders, man, we friends in real life now, huh? Look at you, dude. You like smaller than you look in your picture, but oh fuck it, it don't matter. Hey, I heard you wasn't a big talker, right? But I said just probably need to get settled in. Got that jet lag, you know. So I got a little gift for you. Welcome to Los Santos. Untrack. Hell yeah. I can perform drive-bys. Who your partner is, pimp? Who your partner is? 
Man, dog, I'm glad you're here, man. It's all kinds of opportunities in Los Santos. I mean, that's if you got the nuts to pull them off. And don't even trip, man. Your boy know people all over the city. Like the boy Hal. He is like hands down the best mechanic in town. Or the other boy Simeon, man, he's literally the best bullshit artist in town. Or we can go fuck with the homie G, or any of the homies from family for that matter. Damn. Great. Matter I'm fact, really enjoying looking at this. Right now, see if we can get us a race, you know? <laughs> Social Club was programmed by two people. Um, I believe that. <laughs> Ooh, hey, that's my shit. Okay. Honestly, I'm enjoying the hell out of this, even though this is, again, nine characters. And this is the only one I've seen this introduction of. Still though, mmm. I mean, it's a shame. I'm not. I'm not truly starting over. I won't be able to get first time bonuses if I've already done them. So um, that means I got to do Series A funding and the uh, Criminal Mastermind. Fair enough. I mean, honestly, it would have just been easy to get banned for a sixth time because they completely reset my account. Yeah, dog. This is spot right here. Go post up right there real quick while I make this call. I'm gonna get you a car or something to race in or stare at the back of my shit in. Cause you're gonna eat my dust, punk. <laughs> Shay Shay. Okay. More or nothing. Well, I mean... Oh, okay. Am I forced into this against my will? Okay. I mean, I appreciate this. I mean, um, we'll see how good I truly am at this game. I, I am playing with keyboard and mouse, so, uh, pretty good, honestly. Either way, I wish there was a way to back out of this, but... <laughs> My previous character was a high level than Lamar was. Um, waiting for the players. Okay. I didn't even realise Lamar actually had a GTA Online character, but... Oh well. Ah, okay. So people are actually still starting out in this game. Alright. Rating is 1% though. I'm assuming this race is... Oh, it's 3 miles. Okay, that explains a lot of why this is 1%. Um, how many laps are we doing? Um, okay, which car? Um, I'm gonna say... Shaft is probably the fastest one, right? Uh, and uh, okay, my see. signature favorite emote in the whole game, if I can find it, is uh, find a fish. Please tell me I have unlocked find a fish. Okay, there we go. Hell yeah. Oh, okay. I, I haven't raced a lot in GTA, so uh, I mean, hey, if I win this land race, I'll unlock a bunch of cool and funky things. Name the customization. Ain't no shame in coming second, dog. Somebody gotta do it. Alright, okay. Well, let's see if I made the right choice. Three, two, one, let's go. Right up here, homie. Okay. I'm about to go nice and oh, okay. your bitch ass. I swear this is perfectly, perfectly tuned. Yet, oh, okay. Well, I've never actually taken part in too many races in GTA, so this is gonna be a uh, rude. Wait, hang on a sec. Oh, I swear there are races in this game where you're allowed to use pistols. This is weird to think other people are playing this. Unless they've restarted like I have. Um, I wish there was a way to check my bank account though. Uh, mainly because on one of my character's bank accounts I had 4.4 million. I really hope that, you know... Hey, okay. Um, it was a reasonable detour. They're not that far ahead. I did, I did, did kind of catch up. Yeah, as you can see, my driving skills are not my specialty. My, my skills are stealth killing everyone. Um, or just being sneaky, I suppose. Um, and driving from point to point. I can do that. I don't, I don't mind seven mile drives, but I'll do everything in my power to avoid them. Anyway, all right, some guy is somehow behind me. Um, Funny shit. Now get back to where your ass belongs. I'm not complaining about this song though. I haven't listened to Soul Axe in a while. Yeah, I, I can probably come first if I try. Um, 
I have a feeling those is all script traffic. I'm sorry? That ain't how physics works, son. Come on. See you later, homie. I'm not having the best day, am I? For traffic wise at least. Either way, okay, I guess I bet I guess I can play this tutorial if the game wants me to play this tutorial. I mean, chances are okay, I'm, I'm in position three out three, right? Okay, so this is the guy that ran me off the road at the very beginning. Let's blame him for all my problems and not myself. Please don't smash into that. Okay, there we go. Hey. Well, at least I'm in second, so. Hey, I have something about this race. You can pay me my first little bit of money, so I suppose I can't truly complain. I mean, I suppose the whole kind of point of starting over is ruined if I start off with 4.4 million. But hey. Uh, chances are that's all been lost. At least, my god damn hope it's been lost. Um, yeah, I think it'll still display stats and achievements for my other characters though, so um, don't go around expecting me to be doing uh, the original heists, other than just the ma mainly, you know, scraps of money to get sort of rich. Anyway, there we go. I finished second. I mean, look at, I thought it was almost three minutes long. And it, I, I can't complain about this at all, because I'm now rank two, which is... Uh, going from rank 100 to 2 is... He just gave me the thing. I was going to do a nice dance move where I tried to find a fish. And he just gives me the finger. So, how did Lamar end up with more money than me? Is that just prejudice or something? Probably. Either way. Um, I, get, I suppose if I was playing... Um, I don't know. If I was playing this game for the first time, I would have probably just gotten the achievement Welcome to Los Santos, in which you play GTA Online for the first time. <laughs> I've just opened my phone to check on like random stuff while I wait for this loading screen, because like, they're obviously really long and online, because of the amount of stuff in them. And, uh, yeah. I like how I open a thing and it's just like, how to reset GTA Online character. Anyway, so, uh, yeah, each week there are different discounts and rewards on, so, um, yeah, chances are, um, <laughs> depending on what's on, I will be doing completely different things. Um, anyway, I'm kind of running out of things to talk about, because this is, uh, taking longer than what it should have been. I mean, I suppose I have to be kind of patient. I mean, I, I suppose the real funny thing about this is that my friend went to have his tea dinner, whatever you call it, and um, he's gonna come back and see me that I'm now a rank two and have deleted my two other characters on this game. Um, I really hope this series does well, but hey, I'd, it's mainly for my own personal enjoyment. And I was like, yeah, man, I'm a Dan is something the world could be a lot better without them. Ooh, okay. There's a uh, there's a lot going on. Yes. Can I can I be released from hell now? Man, if you don't get off my phone with this bullshit, why? Man, some people are so clean. Hey, what that shit do? You trying to make some cheese? My boy Gerald G, he looking for somebody low key right now. And to be one thousand with you, I'm thinking you. Look, it's a big exchange of merchandise going down. The Vagos and the Ball Eaters and squash their little uh cultural differences or what the fuck ever. Anyway, why don't you slide down there and see if you can shake up the free market economy a little bit and uh, get that cheese. Hey, I'm gonna text you the boy G address. Don't even trip, he's straight. That's my dog. You know we got you. Okay. I'm gonna need that one Michael location as well. So I'm assuming I just get to keep this car. All right. Oh, am I? Am I locked in? Can I not be released from this hell? Seriously, please, I, I want to be freed. But if I find a new session, would that um, progress will automatically be saved? Okay, so you will gain 20% more RP for completing jobs as part of the team. You also gain an additional 10% if you complete a job with a crew member. Alright. Well, um. I wish there was a way to escape this, um. 
Oh, okay. So learning the ropes alone, easy. But I'm in a session full of other people. Um, okay. <laughs> I really hate my group icon, but it was legit. I'm just in it. I've been in this group for so long. I just don't want to leave because my crew status is so high. Um, anyway. Um, I think I have blue shards as mine most of the time. There we go. Kind of familiar. Oh. Okay, playing this tutorial is making me experience a whole lot different sort of what I would have if I just jumped in head first, which I mean, I'm okay with. Um, earning 4,000 for this is kind of not making me ecstatic, because uh, obvious reasons. Either way. Alright, get the drugs. Is this it? Okay, well, uh, and we got one more. Seems to be a threat. Um, oh, there's, there's someone there. Now he's dead. Um, boop. And, uh, oh, so I have to make my way through here. I I see what you're playing with. Am I even... Oh, right, that person's on the move. Alright, let's go then. Thank God I maxed out my one capacity. Yeah, seriously, um, I'm not sure if you're able to see it, but uh, I maxed out my one capacity because I hate being slow and running in this game. Okay, that person's definitely in some form of car. They have to be, right? I hope so. Either way, my car's probably faster. Um, let's talk about cars. I wonder how the um, game's going to handle me buying the LG for free. Because uh, it's a free car. Anyway, hello friends. You have Jirogas. I want Jirogas. Oh, can I not drive over him? Oh, that's a shame. Right, deliver the drugs to Gerald Taus. It's the most GTA sentence I've ever read. Dude, sir, there's not much else that they can introduce me to, is there? Like, flight school is there for people that want to learn how to fly. They've taught me shooting, they've taught me driving, they've taught me movement, basic camera control. Like, there's not much else that uh, I expect to be thrown at me in this, but yeah, I'm, I'm, en I'm enjoying this, okay? Like, I expected this to be like hell, you know, really simple and boring missions, but so far, this has been a nice introduction. Hey, G, come out here, man. My folks here. What's up, dog? How you doing? <laughs> My character looks so dumb. Well, goddamn, you anti-social motherfucker, you gonna speak? Hey. See, I told you, y'all gonna get along great. Y'all can get to take this shit on the road. How your little ventriloquist act going on? Maybe you can stick your hand up his ass. Give him the dough. Yeah. All right, here. It's right. Don't bother counting it. You get anything else interesting, bring it my way. <laughs> yeah, what I tell you, what I tell you, motherfucker, he like you. And now you got you some bread, what you need to do is go get you some motherfucking gear, because you bummy as fuck. You can't be walking around with me looking like that. You need to better representate yourself, you know what I'm talking about? Hey, G, don't get lost, fool. Come on, man, tear that shit off, man. I need my commission. G, you hear me, dawg? I need my commission, nigga. You about a stingy motherfucker, man. Hey, okay. Honestly, I didn't even realize Gerald was, um... In this game, <laughs> I just expect him to be out one of those contacts in your phone that like nags you to do things. Anyway, um, I wonder if there is a way to release myself from tutorial purgatory, because I sure as I'll hope so. Oh, okay. Right, well, um, we are in online, and we have a adequate amount of money. Don't, don't worry, I'm not going to spend it. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get... I'm going to get things that specifically will give me money on hand, um, just for this episode. And then, uh, off camera I'll make another character, skip the tutorial, and throw all the money onto them. Um, so just context, ignore that 4.4 million, even though I could use it to buy so much crap. Um, you have no idea. Um, anyway, we got... I just can't buy anything over that much amount of money. And, uh... I mean, I, I want to invest correctly. Um, one good thing is that uh, 
the game sort of already knows how good I am. Where am I? Um, yeah, never at rank three. Okay, so it did reset my rank. Um, oh, that's a shame. <laughs> I have to get to rank five. Um, and I, I don't really want to end this here. I kind of want to keep the whole thing, you know, moving, grooving. We'll, we'll rob one store, okay, and then we'll call it a day. Um, because I kind of need to hop off and, uh, you know. Let's just say, remove this money that I don't really want. Okay, how rich do you have to be to say, I don't really want this money? <laughs> like, obviously I take it as a little startup fee, but I think being broke in this game is probably more fun than being rich in this game. And those are the words of a complete deranged lunatic. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see how this goes, though. Um, hopefully good. Hopefully. Yeah. I mean, I'll be probably earning less money for first-time bonuses, but I don't really care all that much about them. It's just kind of dumb challenges that I've already done. Anyway, I have a pistol. You have a cash register. Okay, let's go. Well, I know the drill with these things. Um, one, let me over the desk, and there we go. Obviously, I'm going to shoot him in the school for intimidation factor. But, uh, don't mind me, I'm going to show you what happens to you if, in the event you defy me. Now, please give me money. So I can uh, escape the police and become very rich. Yeah. There goes the family vacation. I mean, I had to do it. Escaping from three star wanted level is better than escaping from a two star wanted level. Anyway, let's get a move on. Our first police escape. I mean, I suppose right now I, I'm already familiar with Los Santos, but I don't know, I'm already going back to RCA and I've been off the plane for what, 15 something minutes? I mean, I might, I might as well escape. Um, it'd be interesting to see this, though. Um, it's always, in, it's always enjoyable. So, it's not even a thing. It's always fun to restart in this game, I think, because you see all those cutscenes and you do all those story missions again, like that were introduced with each DLC, and you kind of know what's better, what's worse. And because of that, it's sort of, I don't know, it kind of takes away like that initial wonder you had, but at the same time, I don't know. I guess it just kind of makes it a bit more easy, easy breezy. Yeah, seriously though, my first stop after this is a goddamn clothing shop. I mean, we'll, we'll see how long I can stay in my starting clothes before I'm able to change out of them because I, I <laughs> white t-shirt, okay, uh, multi-colored psychedelic shorts, not so okay. <laughs> Anyway, um, I, I'm doing surprisingly well considering my driving skill is awful. Um, yeah, I think though, as long as I know roughly the basics of this game, uh, no wacker skill can really stop me. <laughs> that and the sheer amount of luck I have on my side. Okay. Anyway, come on, is there a security guard here that I can kill for some RP? No? Shame. Oh, seriously though, um, so I think the structure of these episodes might change from week to week, in the because uh, now whenever I play GTA, I can be like, oh yeah, let me record, because I mean, that just makes it ten times more fun, um, especially since, um, yeah, I think some of my friends aren't exactly the richest people in this game, so it'd be kind of fun to see if they can help me out in sort of random goals, but I thought for this episode specifically, I kind of have a live commentary, because starting over in this game never gets old, I mean, story mode does get old, I mean, I don't know, there's something about GTA Online, which is just really, really cool to start over in. But, um, I think it's going to wrap this up. Um, we, so far we've earned $4,511, which is, so far I think the most money we'll ever make. Um, don't worry, we'll, we'll, we'll start making the bank. I'm not an idiot, I know exactly how to do, because uh, I have a little friend down here. The tutorial is never over, is it? Uh, I mean, we could continue, honestly. And I'm quite down to continue. Kind of a longer first episode. Um, we will go for like two more minutes, but honestly, after that, there's no other way this tutorial can keep me any longer. No way. Unless they want me to go to a gun store by a shooting range, complete the fleecer job. I highly doubt they want me to do the fleecer job, but uh, never know. Um, as I was saying though, quick job is going to be my best friend today. Mainly because um, I can, namely, I don't want to do the Diamond Casino heist because um, 
a lot of people in back, just invite their friends to that. But for the Doomsday Heist, which is kind of more difficult, I'm definitely just going to be sort of leeching off them sometimes and whatnot. And, you know, sometimes off camera I'll do some work, but mainly I want to do everything I do on camera. Uh, it must be interesting, though, because uh, unlike every other time I've played this game, this is, you know, specifically, like, beginning to end. So, uh, I don't know, this can always work as a nice little filler content, I suppose. Anyway, um, alright, so, yeah, clothing in this game is really stupid. Like, stupidly expensive. Uh, that looks horrific, okay. Like, uh, the vibe! You see you like? <laughs> yeah, okay, I, I will be, I will become the vibe. Um, ah, uh, it's not, <laughs> at least, okay, am I, am, am I free from the tutorial? Am I able to use quick chop? Not, alright, fair enough. You know, it's not—it's not like I need quick job to start making myself some good old money, but uh, just saying. But yeah, we'll, we'll see how this goes. Um, I'm quite happy to see where this is going. And oh, I love this song, so it's perfect to end on. Yeah, I always have the radio on in this, so I don't care. I don't wanna fall in love. Seriously, though, I always be recording when I'm playing this, and then sometimes, you know, it'll be live commentary where I'm messing around, and sometimes it'll be a uh, double. Whatever works, I suppose. But I suppose that wraps it up. I don't think there's any of the tutorial crap that I have to sit through. Let's get this I mean... Hey, hey, oh. it's your boy LD. If you need to get some cheese real quick, fuck with me. We got licks all over town just waiting to get hit. Just walk in with the blam blam and point it at the fool behind the counter. He gonna break bread. And they insured, don't nobody give a fuck no way. It's all good. I've been peeping this one spot they've been making a gang of bread. You down with that shit? One of the homies gonna meet you at the store to help you knock that motherfucker over. Okay. Uh, I hope I'm free from this. I, 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 I'm never free from the tutorial, am I? Um. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop this and I'm gonna finish first of the tutorial myself because this is weird. So, um, yeah, if you enjoyed this, then be sure to tell me what you want to see me do. Leave a thumbs up, possibly subscribe, turn notifications, leave a comment down below. But, with all that said, and all that aside, thanks for watching, guys. My name is Vinoramic, and peace out.